الحمد لله وحده والصلاة والسلام على مولانا رسول الله وآله وصحبه Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, it is a great pleasure for me to take part in the launch of the United Nations Decade of Ocean Science for Sustainable Development. Coordinated by UNESCO, this commendable initiative reflects a growing awareness of the role of oceans in our history and of their importance for the present and the future of humanity. My country, Morocco, is a long stretch of land bordered by 3,500 kilometers of water, providing access to two seas, the Mediterranean Sea and the Atlantic Ocean. For generations, immense stretches of water have brought us together rather than separate us from the world. Our oceans are infinitely generous. They contain considerable fishery resources which make their preservation an economic issue of paramount importance. What is more, the majority of our population now live on the coast. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, in Morocco, I am in a position to bear testimony to the active personal commitment of His Majesty, King Mohammed VI, who set up the foundation I am honored to chair and which deals with climate and environmental issues. Thanks to His Majesty's leadership, Morocco is today a front runner in the field of renewable energy. As the host of COP22 held in Marrakesh, the Kingdom lent its decisive support to several initiatives such as the Blue Belt for Sustainable Fishery and Aquaculture in Africa. In 2018, the Moroccan Royal Navy acquired a state-of-the-art scientific vessel to carry out hydrographic and oceanographic research. The foundation I chair began its activity 20 years ago with a program to clean up the kingdom's shores. Since then, our scope of action has grown considerably. Measures to protect seas and oceans are an essential part of our work today. In particular, we work with our fellow citizens, especially children, on raising awareness of the fragility of our coastline and the dangers of plastic waste. Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, maritime ecosystems are under pressure. Various fishery stock and known seabed resources are overexploited. However, oceans and seas, which account for more than 70% of the surface of our planet, remain mostly underexplored. The potential wealth contained in the ocean is largely unknown. One of mankind's true common possessions, this wealth must be used in a sustainable, responsible, and fair manner. For this reason, the decade we are launching is a magnificent opportunity. It will provide the kind of high-level scientific knowledge 
we need to better protect our seas and the extraordinary biodiversity they contain. This decade will generate global scientific solidarity of which Africa is in great need. Therefore, the Mohammed VI Foundation for Environmental Protection is both proud and excited to join the decade of ocean science. We will take our role and responsibility in this alliance to heart. On a more personal level, I am honored to be a sponsor of this alliance and take part in this global endeavor for the benefit of seas and oceans. Through my humble person, Morocco wishes to thank you and the United Nations for this initiative to which we will actively contribute. Together with you, we will promote this decade of knowledge for the benefit of our seas and oceans for the present and future generations. Thank you. I wish you every success. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh.